Bro, my guy just killed those two guys, yo. Now she knows she's actually, like, might actually die. What's up, guys? It's Celeviathan, and we are back with another reaction today. Today, we are continuing Eden Zero. We're on episode 8, and I am loving this anime i don't know what it is um i've looked up a lot of uh i guess you can say uh opinions about it and it turns out that a lot of people enjoy it more than fairy tale or any other past work by um hero Masa masahima i believe that's what it is whatever <laughs> i always mess it up every video but whatever um <laughs> So, uh, this is probably his best work, people have said. So, um, I'm refraining from reading the manga because I really want to. I mean, from what I, from what I've been, like, reading and hearing, it sounds like it gets crazy at some point in the show. So, and I know that this is only going for, I think, 25 episodes. So, it's only going for one season. I was hoping it could be a long-running running anime, but I don't think it is. I think it's going to be in, based in on, um, I guess, seasons. So, whatever. Um, so last episode, just a quick recap, we, we got a meet, I guess you can say, Elsie Crimson, not really, but we, um, we had, uh, what's it called, Cheeky fighting her and stuff like that, and we realized that the whole crew was just a bunch of, like, zombie, um, what's it called, parasite things, it wasn't even really Elsie's crew, it was, um, apparently that ship that they were on was actually the old Demon King's old ship, and it's actually Cheeky's ship, so now that vessel is actually Shiki's and um we f come to find out that Elsie and uh the demon king whatever the demon lord I think it was demon lord the demon lord and Elsie used to be like homies or something in the past and the demon lord actually went out on an adventure to go look for mother so that was actually really cool to find out too and also the fact that he actually gave up on that adventure because of uh Shiki and that um, he either had to um, continue on and risk Shiki dying or come back to Granville and have Shiki be raised and grow up there. So it was a pretty hard decision, but to have Shiki carry on the Demon Lord's will is actually really cool. I like that. And um, finally, we come to find out what the actual title of the show means. So Eden Zero... This whole time I'm thinking, is it Shiki? Is it the power? Is it like some kind of thing that... No, it's the damn ship. So Eden Zero is actually the ship. <laughs> so that that was a little cool tidbit to find out. Anyway, um, we're going to get started with episode 8 now. Um, I'm super excited. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Turn on notifications on the bottom to make sure you check out whenever I go put up a new video. And um, make sure you check out the Patreon below uh, the link. I don't know. I'm just tired. <laughs> the Patreon link below. Um, so you can get full uncut reactions of this show many more. And uh, without further ado, we're going to get started with uh, Eden Zero Episode 8. Let's go. You know, I see I told you he was gonna be the new Demon King. I wonder what its true strength is, though. I mean, if they're gonna be leaving and going out of the Sakura Cosmos. Wait, 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 there's four, there's three more entities that make up the Demon King's, I guess, his, uh, his crew? Dragon Fall is the same as the Dragon Fall. The Dragon Fall is the same as the Dude, I want to actually see what these dragons are, though. I hope we get to see it in this episode, but I doubt it. <laughs> Torture pleasure massage. 
<laughs> that that was pretty crazy. <laughs> Jeez, yo, that's crazy. の so do you need those three other robots before they're even able to get out of the Sakura Cosmos? It sounds like they're needed, I think. あ、気持ちいい。あなたは会話するとき、机や椅子に気を使いますか？スカーガン生。それと同じです。これ何が入ってんだ？ 指揮様、心は私にもあるのでしょうか？ Bro, machines all have hearts, man. They all do, man. ありがとう。私、指揮様の旅についていきたい。何と呼びすれば。何でもいいよ。では、ご主人で。ジギー様と同じ言葉を。ノーマンも死んでるんだろ。帰る気はね。かと言ってお前らと行く気もねえし。
それが心と心をつなぐ始まりの一歩になる Bro, the animation in the show is actually so good. I actually love it. It's so much better than anything I've seen produced from Fairy Tale ever. Yo, what the hell is that thing, man? Holy shit. Ugh. This guy's this guy's kidnapping girls and he's and he's like crystallizing them, man. <laughs> oh my god, and you're trying to tell me that this cyborg is working with that creeper, Iligia or whatever his name is? Oh my god. Yo, this man's a real hero right now, man. He just saved a whole bunch of people's lives, yo. Holy. Yo, they're gonna have a nice battle soon in the future. I guarantee it, yo. Whatever this panic guilt is, man, I, I, I can't wait to go. Jeez. Oh no, it was Re did Rebecca get kidnapped, man? No, Rebecca got kidnapped, yo. Oh no, that's why he's gonna go to Panagilst, man. No. Oh no, man. Multiple kidnappings. Important blue. Oh my god, yo. This guy's like kidnapping a whole bunch of girls, yo. The show, yo, the show gets so dark, too. Yo, this is only episode 8 right now, man. Yo, this is getting already so, like, intense. We finally got our fourth member coming to the crew, man. Fourth member incoming right now. <laughs> so that was episode 8 of Eden Zero. Oh my god, man. I can't. It show honestly, man. It just gets so... Oh my god, yo. Like, that, this show just gets so much more, like, enticing every arc. I don't know what it is. Like, the first arc was interesting. Then the next arc was a lot more interesting. And now this arc is, like, so much more interesting. Oh my god, I can't wait till we get to Panic Gilst and we get to see what goes on with, with all of that. Ugh. But anyway, quick recap with all of that. We got to, um... Uh, see a little bit and get a little bit of backstory about the crew of Eden Zero, at least the robotic crew. And I think they're gonna need to get the other three, um, I guess you can say crew, because I think what those bots do essentially are like maintenance for the ship. So you need all three of those bots to kind of have the ship um, function at like full power, I guess you can say. Um, 
essentially, um, so they're gonna need to, I guess, collect those or find them, I guess, before they actually get out of the Sakura Cosmos. So there's gonna be, a, I guess, a lot more little side stories that come in between until they can actually get out of the Sakura Cosmos and go to Dragonfall, which is another place that they talked about being like the gate between other, uh, I guess you can say, galaxies. Um, Dragonfall, place with all the dragons, that sounds very interesting to me. Um, I don't know what these dragon things are. They look robotic, but um, who knows? Either way, it's whatever. Um, more into the recap, they go back to Blue Garden, then we find that Iligia guy is actually collecting these girls, man, these B cubers, and he's doing some weird shit, man. And he looks weird as hell, man. Ugh, like disgusting. And I don't know how this is like allowed. But, like, they put up on news, like, there's been multiple kidnappings of B-Cubers, so clearly it's not something that's normal. And it seems to be something that, like, these, like, the laws here don't seem to, like, protect, or, like, they're not very... <laughs> I've never seen anything be so open about kidnappings. I, I would assume they'd be, like, very calculated, but this guy's just like, I want that one, I want that one, I want that one, you're gonna get me that one. And it's, like, a freaking grocery store bargain sale. It's stupid, whatever. <laughs> anyway, that was Eden Zero Episode 8. I cannot wait for Episode 9. We finally going to meet the fourth member of the crew that's in the opening. So we got Rebecca, we got Shiki, we got Wise, and we're going to get the fourth person right now. This girl looked pretty interesting in the um, the opening, essentially. Like, she has, like, uh, red ether gear. So I'm assuming her ether gear is probably fire from what it looked like. But we'll see what happens and and um i'm pretty sure rebecca's is gonna be water ether gear just by the color too and just like connection with blue garden and all that other stuff but um anyway that was a great episode i'm so excited for the, more of this show i will uh see you guys around um i hope you guys are all doing great i hope you guys all have a great day i hope you guys are all staying safe right now during this pandemic still you know it's still kind of a thing right now and i hope it, the world can kind of get back to where it needs to be soon but let's not talk about sad things right now <laughs> i will see you guys around a little bit tidbit for the future remember when you change a light bulb always turn off the light switch first little little piece of advice there but <laughs> i'll see you guys around bye